I can be played, but I'm not a board game. I have keys, but I don't have any locks. I have hammers, but I don't have any nails. I have pedals, but I'm not a bicycle. I can be tuned, but I'm not a radio. What am I? The piano. Hello, my name is Alina Horvat. I'm a piano teacher at the RCS Early Years Music and Junior Conservatoire. Let me introduce my good friend, Albert. Albert is a wee pal from Glasgow, as you can also see it on his shirt. He's already a piano expert. Would you like to see him play? Come, he's going to show you about the piano. The piano has 88 keys, 52 white keys and 36 black keys. When you press the key down, a hammer strikes a string inside the piano and produces a musical sound. The white keys are named after the first seven letters of the alphabet. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. By pressing these keys down in a specific order, you can play beautiful melodies on the piano. Albert has started playing nursery songs. At home, he practices a little every day to get better and better at the pieces. And in his spare time, he also loves listening to music. I'm sure you can recognize his favorite tune. If you listen to the sound of the piano really carefully, you can probably spot different characters. For example, a little bird singing on the trees. change the instrument sound in various ways. The modern grand piano has usually three pedals, but my upright piano only has two. The soft pedal or una corda, which makes the sound less bright and soft. And the sustaining pedal or damper on the right hand side, which allows the strings vibrate freely inside the body of the piano and therefore creating a little foggy and echoey color. Doesn't it sound like a bagpipe on Buchanan Street? Albert takes 30 minute long lessons at RCS. He comes once a week after his musicianship class on Sunday. He's a diligent student and always remembers to bring his books to the lesson. There are plenty of reasons why you might want to play the piano. The piano has a beautiful relaxing sound and you can play the most wonderful pieces on it. 
You can share music with your friends and family, and you can even make music together. Music is an international language that everyone understands all around the world. You can learn more about cultures and other countries through their music. Did you know that Albert Einstein also played the piano? As he said, I see my life in terms of music. He confessed to thinking about science in terms of images often drawn directly from his experiences as a musician. If you would like to learn more about the piano, make new friends, learn lots of fun music games, come and join RCS Early Years Music Course. See you soon!